Hi everyone, thanks for checking out our short demo of um, file management within Vine 3.2 and some of the really cool stuff that's coming out. Um, so you're looking at my Mac desktop right now, you know, for, um, for a long time now, Teaming and now Vibe have been able to do um, file management and in-place editing, which works on any platform. So that's why I'm showing you on Mac um, and the same thing works for Windows. So for example, if I'm accessing a Word file here, I can decide to edit this file and it will bring up the file in this case in LibreOffice. So I can edit the file and make changes and this is live and it saves it back right into Vibe. So saving to Vibe. I can make any changes to the document and when I hit the save button it will go back and be saved as a Word file in Vibe. Now if I bring back my document here and I do a quick view you can see that the text that I added is already there. So this is live, real-time editing. So, I mean, it, there's a bit of a process here of accessing the file and doing the in-place edit, but still, it's a far cry from having to be in the network, you know, on the network, inside the organization, having the map drive and having access to your files. So for a lot of organizations, getting away from these map drive and having access like this to your files from anywhere is a huge jump. But, you know, with Vime 3.2 coming out now in November 2011, uh, Novell is getting geared up to improve the user experience specifically for Windows users and it's going to make it even easier for users to access their files. Let's switch to um, my Windows desktop here and you can see I've got Word here, Microsoft Word 2007. Now normally you know we navigate to the file folder like you just saw and edit the file from there but now there's a new plugin that'll be coming out and this will add to the ribbon bar a Vibe tab. And from here, one of the things we can do is open and up comes this dialog where we can open now files directly from Vibe. I think that's pretty cool. And so I'll go to my file folder where I was here and here's my file that I was looking at and I can open the file and here it is. Not only that, but this little Vibe metadata window comes up here and I can do things like rate the document, I can write a comment, and stuff like that and just hit enter. I can add a description if I want. So if I can click this here, um, this is an old document. I yeah, have configure LDAP with the client 32, but still. And I can make changes. I can decide to remove this and get rid of that. And when I'm done editing, I will save, making sure that I'm on the Vibe tab here. Now let's close the document and go back to Vibe. I'll just refresh the folder here. And you can see that this little indicator tells me that some changes have happened. I've got one comment. So if I go to the file, I can now see the comment, the description actually that I added, as well as the comment. And if I add a comment, I can say, um, a nice document, it was thanks, and hit enter. All right, so now I've got these documents. You can see the star rating I had put on the document. Now if we go back here and open the document again, I will see that the comment that I added also shows up here. Now, you know, one of the more um, annoying parts of creating new documents and getting them up in Vibe is you have to create your new document, initially save it somewhere, like maybe on your desktop, um, and then, you know, close the document, open up your file folder in Vibe and then drag it in there or add the new file entry and all of its descriptions. But with this new shortcut, what we can now do is save directly into Vibe. So for example, let's create a new document here. This is a new document. And once I'm done, I'm going to make sure I'm on my Vibe tab and I'm going to say save. And again, up comes this dialog from Vibe, right? And I can say my document and I'll save it as a Word document. Up comes this list so I can decide to use the some of the folders from my teams or I can click the browse button and navigate down to any team I want. Um, in this case I'm just gonna select my own personal folder here. Additional properties. So if I don't specify a title it's going to use the document name as the title um, but I'm just gonna give it a title here and give it a description as well and I will save it. 
and that's all there is to it. Here comes the metadata box. And if I go back to Vibe, exit this folder here and just refresh, you can see that my super document is here and with the description and everything included. So I can rate it. I can add a comment. This is neat. Yes, it is. Say OK. And as I go back to my document and start keep editing, within a couple of seconds, this document will also show up. And here it is. This is neat. So it's live, real time. It's always talking to the Vine backend. Whatever comments are being added or ratings or description will show up. So you can almost chat with you know users who are commenting on your document. So this is going to work with Word, Excel, and all the Office Suite for 2007 and 2010. This plugin is due to be released by Novell sometime early in the new year. We're hoping and expecting January, February time frame. Um, I know that we've been talking about this to several customers and they've been really excited. It's just going to make it that much easier for users to access and edit documents straight out of Vibe. Now keep in mind, this doesn't only work when you're on the local network. You can be sitting at home in your home office on your couch at night having a beer or whatever and opening up Vibe or your, your Word or Excel and editing your documents directly out of that. This will work from outside the local network as well. Very secure, everything over HTTPS, authentication done through your directory, whether that's e -direct Directory or Active Directory. So we think this is a great addition to the Vibe family and I think a lot of customers will be happy. Keep in mind if you're already a Novell Open Workgroup Suite customer since August, Novell has um, added Vibe as part of your entitlement. If you need help, please visit the Adaris website. We have a great offer called Get Your Vibe, which is a, a one-week on-site engagement to help you going, get going with Vibe and deploy it. If you're not already a Novell customer and are looking at a collaboration platform, Keep in mind, this is not specific to Novell infrastructure environments. This works just as well in the Microsoft Active Directory environments. We have deployed them in those environments, and they integrate beautifully. All we need is LDAP to your Active Directory for your authentication, and we're done. Um, so check out our website. Check out the Vibe website on Novell, and don't hesitate to call us if you have any questions about Vibe. It would be our pleasure to help. Thanks for joining in.